Like, and like what, is it like a, what kind of car? Like, so if you're hey, you got about hey, look, you got a. I told you about okay. my business. You can ask about that. Okay, okay. If you're not paying the okay, rent for okay. the shops. Oh, but you came on here saying you had three shops. Now you're saying. You're you're getting hostile no, because I don't care what they put. They could all put. They could on my page right on. there. I'm the hottest it's, youngin in New York City. Period. Do what I need to do. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. So you're okay. Damn man, I'm not so hostile. Not, Honestly, so I hostile I'm glad anymore. for the you're opportunity happy. to join your live. It's no hostility needed. I'm just here to promote my business. So if anyone wants to put. Mm -hmm. Okay, well, well so at yeah, Bride Studio, Bride Dot Studio, this is my go page ahead. here. You guys can follow me. Yeah. If ladies, if you want to get your hair done, you can come get your hair done. You know, if men want to sponsor their girl and get their hair done, you can. I'm the I'm young, I'm 22, and I'm doing what I need to do and to thrive as a girl, period. So hello. Um I like how you pin that down. Calm her down. Okay. Nah, that's nice. I like how you pin that. Why can't y'all pin that I'm a young entrepreneur doing my thing? No, so my, so, no, pin no. that. Because they don't mm. really, they don't really know. Like see, this was this, this. I'm going off what they're saying, which I know you don't care. Okay. But that's why I'm. That's why mm -hmm. I get off and have okay. other people join. So yeah. somebody's in New York, right? About to want to add me, and you in Brooklyn, right? Okay. Okay. Let me let me add them there in Brooklyn too. Okay. They just told me to add them. They, I think they know you, so I'm gonna get back on there. Okay, all right. Let's see something. So now, um, okay. See this thing, y'all. You know, like, like. With me, everything has to like all the way make sense, like all the way. So, like most of the time, you have to understand, like when y'all dealing with people, like let's say if I say I got ten businesses, like if I got ten businesses, every every business comes with like you know rent. So most likely, you know the rent and everything else and the employees and all that stuff has to get paid. So, um. It just have to be all, all around. Now, to me, if a person is young and they are, you know, doing good in life, you know, it is show. That's why, like, one thing about it is, is like, um, you have to really like pay attention to people, even their surroundings, what they're driving, how they live in, the background of them, everything. Even if, you know, what I'm saying, like, like I just told y'all, like me, like, I can say. Like I spend a lot of money on ads, as y'all. I just uh, what three fifty, right? Three hundred fifty thousand, boom, on ads. So like, let's say if I say I want to do promo, I say promo, then I run ads behind it. I spend fifteen thousand dollars behind my promo, and I get it to probably three million people. So if I get twenty thousand people to pay two hundred dollars, do the math. You get what I'm saying? So that is what I'm trying to tell people. Like, you don't have to know. You understand what I'm saying? It got to make sense, kid. Shit got to make sense. Everything got to make sense. I'm just, I was drunk. I was listening to you talking, but um, I think this is good that you do. This is like extra exposure. Too. I'm looking kind of like, I'm here home doing reports. I'm not like dolled up right now. I'm actually from Florida. Okay. What you got I'm, going on? Where you from? I'm. I watch you. I follow you because I'm intrigued with like the independence. Okay. Right. And like aggressive, but I'm like um. My oh yeah. You gotta be. When you you first, how old? How old were you? Well, I'm, I'm actually I manage corporation uh, salons, so I manage corporate salons, but I have independent business too. Um, mm -hmm. So let me ask you something: When girls, like when you see girls, right, um, like 
because it's a difference when like girls like let's say if, let's say if a person uh, you got a girl and they work inside of a shop okay but they act like they own the shop mm -hmm. how do you feel about that? and so like for me like okay I, like well corporation when i get people, people that come aboard to like corporation and structure is very much the rules is like goals you got to hit certain numbers sometimes they're like yeah. very independent they don't really take like the structure so i feel like independent versus like corporation if you have like a lot of clientele if you're doing um honestly i'm a numbers person if you're not doing twenty five thousand a revenue a week with overhead costs you're not recovering money and that's just they don't have like insurance they don't have you know 401k pension like that so i'm right. all for independence that's why i like i'm intrigued with people who are Yeah, they don't have PPAs. They don't file taxes. Mm -hmm. They just on here just cap. That's why I be telling you, I will act dumb as hell and listen yeah. to them talk and know that they're lying mm -hmm. instantly. But I just, it's just, I just entertain them, and I just be like, okay, yeah. So how much do you pay in rent, and how much is this, and how much is that, and see if I catch them and then they get an attitude with me. You understand what I'm saying? But it's still all entertainment at the end of the day because I know how the business works. That's why it's important business, personal business, I mean personal credit, business credit so you can use all the free money around you to build your business. You feel me? Oh shit, your Wi-Fi. You need to get your Wi-Fi fixed. That thing ain't working right now. Yeah, when I oh. <sighs> Hold on, folks. Hold on. Hold on yeah. Oh, shit. There's hella niggas on here. There's hella niggas on here, folks. There's all types of guys on here, folks. See what they are. What the fuck? 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 What Business credit, don't get you right. So let's see what let's see what this do right here. No, my connection ain't tripping. Damn, I can't yeah, ain't no what about it. What the fuck? Ain't nobody accepting this, so. Um... So none of y'all phones work for some reason. Man, I, I swear I just added like four people, folks. Maybe it is my Wi-Fi. Maybe. I don't know. I just turned that shit off. Okay. They decline. Let's see who else. They decline, folks. They decline. Let's see who this is. I'm just going to add who, all types of people until somebody pick up, bro. What's up, what? Uh, <coughs> post come on. Nah, she's nah, she smoking What's up, on the gas. <coughs> uh, that motherfucker like a black and mad. So, so let me ask you something. Did you light it when you first, like, so when you picked up the phone, did you light the, uh, um, yeah, this is blue. Cigarette when you first picked up the phone? Oh, that's a blunt? Oh, okay. Yeah. Because you know what I notice about when, when I notice when I go live with people, right? The very first, like, let's say if they, let's say if they got a blunt and that motherfucker been sick, the very first thing they do, folks, they hurry up, grab that, the blunt, that, accept the live. That's some young like niggas who want to look cool, bro. Smoke and then get the you know the young generation. 27. 
How old, how old, how old are you, folks? Yo, yeah, 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 I eat the crib. Okay, <laughs> shit, what you at the crib? So, like, you like when I get on people live, right? It's like you got on the live, so you just invited me in your crib, right? Nah, the roof. So, what are you smoking in the bathroom? Nah, not right now, fool. Chilling, fool. You don't got no female or nothing over there? I'm from the boot, but I stay in order to Texas, huh? Where you from, folks? Oh, I stay with somebody. You smoking good gas. You got your own crib. <coughs> yeah, somebody. I'm fucked up, bro. <coughs> I just, <coughs> I just oh, got out from doing six and shit. Huh? Oh, yeah. It's, it's my granny. I just got out from doing six years. Hey, y'all just did six years, bro. On some shit. But, but I be fucking with that music, though, fool. You just got out. out you just got out. Nine months. Um, so look, I really, I'm, I'm working, really trying to get right. She, everybody up right now, though. So look, it, look. Huh? I was saying, I was saying, so you just got out. Now, what you say, so bro? You say it again. One more time. Nah, this my angle. You good. What you say, bro, bro? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I said, so look, you been out for nine months? Yeah, I just did six. Yeah. I left for 16. Just and you just got out in 22. Oh, you yeah. left in 16? Yeah, I'm, I'm on papers. Damn, you, you ain't on papers? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Then, I only I only got three more months on paper though, fool. Let me take my shit out. I mean, this hoe looking crazy. You the, I did, I told you I stay with Granny. They on this hoe rip. So, so, so they don't do. Nah, they don't. Nah, they ain't shooting so, on you. I so got three months left on parole. It's like it's nothing. Like you know what I'm saying? Even if. It's the worst you can do is, you know what I'm saying? Go to jail three months. But they not even going to do that. They ain't pressing three months. I'll cut the fake. Nah, I'll they ain't going to do all fun. that, bro. I ain't going to jail for no weed. They ain't going to do all that. So, so I'm saying, though, you got out, you've been out for nine months, right? Nine months is a long shit, time. Shit, I really been working. I got a call. I so had, a, I had a little appointment, fool. I got... CT, fuck. I mean, I got evicted fucking around and shit. I had all, I mean, shit, I just got a car right now. Trying to get back my apartment and shit, fool. Chilling. So, um, you 27. You ain't bumping up. Like, you ain't uh -huh. gonna say, because you know how they is in jail, shit. They'll take anything, folks, to get that visit. But right now, you kind of in that same boat, for You damn them might just have to get yeah. on Tinder and bump like a fat Fuck bitch. no, Kimbo. Yeah, yeah, no. Girl. You might dead, have to bro. just really just... Look, see, so look, you playing game. <laughs> you playing. Look, guys, mean, I see what you on. You on some old bullshit. <laughs> you on some bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> listen, listen, listen. I'm saying, do you want to put, do you, uh, are you trying no, to put this, no. you want me to help you with this? I mean, I mean, I don't, I, I mean, look, this, look, right, on my mama, boy, you, listen, listen. hey, on my listen. mama, uh, Kevo boy, I'm trying. when I came home, I just seen, like, they post you, uh, boom, when they post it, I see you, you up, you doing your thing, I say, I say, oh, bro doing this thing, bro, lit, how old you is? Yeah. So how long did it take you to? I just turned 30. The, uh, like, build all your, you know what I'm saying? I've been okay. the same okay. way since I was 18. That's a long time. And then legit, though. That's a long though, time of balling, ain't Legit, that's, that's, that's the part. No, I was, to be honest. Yeah. 
I wasn't legit when I was oh, first balling. Yeah. But I was still balling. You feel me? Crazy. Like, I'm shocked that you 20 something. Yeah. And, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. If I was you, this is what I would do. Let me just tell you. Yeah. Do you smoke cigarettes? Yeah. Okay. You smoke cigarettes and weed. All right, look. You got two habits, two really bad habits. Yeah. Like you got about a lot of money right yeah. now. You going, it's going to that. Yeah. Like honestly, you got it. Hey, look, 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 look. Do that. Look, look, look. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I stay. This, this ain't sound right. This ain't sound right. Bro, I can't this. put too much on there. But I stay here. But I don't. You know what I'm saying? I can't say too much on live, bro. Um, yeah, I can't. Uh, you know what I'm saying? Oh. But listen, I'm going to just say this now. I'm going to just say this yeah. now. In your situation, you feel me? You got to let baby them know. You got to let baby them know. Listen, babe. You got to you gotta have a real big dog talk with her. Listen, I just did six. I've been out for nine months. It's ugly out here. I need to put this yeah. play together. You gotta see. You gotta set her down to talk to her. She gonna say, "Baby, what's the play?" You yeah. know what I mean? Hey, you gonna spend about a hey, week. Hey, Kimbo, two let me let me let me hit this this song. You you. On, I see I see they ripping. They don't they don't know. You know what I'm saying? Let me hit some for you. All right. Hey, I say uh. Go ahead. I'm gonna bro. hit the beat on time. I say uh. Mm, Say, what's that about? Hey, niggas do shit just to get a little clot. Hey, I know they gonna plot. Hey, I know that they didn't want to see me on top. Hey, but now I can't drop. Hey, I can't see myself going back to my block. This for my dogs got me feeling like Whopper got flavor. I went cop the chain and the watch. Hey, but what's that about? Hey, niggas do shit just to get a little clot. Hey, I know they gonna plot. Hey, I know that they didn't want to see me on top. Hey, but now I can't drop. Hey, I can't see myself going back to my block. This for my dogs got me feeling like wow, I got flavor. I went cop the chain in the watch. Nah, for real. I went cop the watch and it came with a chain. I took off like a dun. You say had to stay in my lane. Because I done seen niggas change with a did them, but wasn't in range. Niggas throw shit in the L, but I know they went there. Only talking because I went there. Niggas be acting like this, but they really not that. With a spoon, but really don't care. I'm at the top and I'm over the edge. I'm double checking the bread. Came a long way. I was just making spreads, man. I'm really a dog. I just want to get fed and I can't take it back when it's already said. Hey, they won't do nothing about it. No, most of these niggas, they come from the most these niggas depend on their pond. Hey, but what's that about? Hey, I really fucked that whole up, but you know what I'm saying? Just on some shit. You know what I'm saying? I ain't gonna lie. But like it's you I could tell you was in jail rapping sure. doing like sure. you was beating on the tape, beating on the uh being rapping like that and shit. It's hard though, but you know what I you know the bad thing about niggas though, when they do rap. Like, like you know, you can be hard because you see how it sound wrong. Like, but it's sometimes it's harder to say it through the mic or on a beat. Then the Wi Fo's Wi Fi went out. Damn, Granny. Damn, Granny. Damn. Nah, folks hard. Folks hard to see, I ain't gonna lie. But I'm saying, I know, like, I was in that shit before, folks. When I tell you, when they go lay it down on a beat, and, I'm, and uh, they be used to, like, saying it out loud so it don't be sounding right, but it's it's hard, though. I used to listen to them niggas rap all day when I was locked up. All oh, niggas wanna do it. Let me let you, let me, let me rap for you, bro.
भाई मेरा ही फ्लोर बता दो भाई हेलो हेलो लोवर मेरा भी है लोवर हमको ही फ्लोवर चाहिए भाई फ्लोवर की तो वही भाई फ्लोइंग के पास कार है लम्बनदिनी लम्बनदिनी है लम्बकिनी पर है यो लम्बकिनी है लम्बकिनी है तो है लम्बकिरी दिखाओ है क्या Oh. No. We can. Travel. Who are you? Who are you? Hello. Hello. Come on, man. Who are you? Yeah. Who are you? Like, how did you find me? Are you high? Well, why are you laying there? Hey, show us around. Let me see around. Let me see the house. Why? Where are you from? Is is getting really weird, and just you staring at the phone, and you got this like pink wall right here, and then it's blue right there. Wow. There's some lady yelling in the back, and you waving, huh? Oh, you got off. Okay. Where do these people come from? Oh wow! P 
people from over the world, Brody. I need to stop running ads in certain places. I be running ads everywhere. It's all types of people be on that bitch. Whoever I just added, it taking too long. He showed it. He had good Wi-Fi. I ain't gonna cap. Dude, you know how long I just waited to like fucking get on this live? Like thirty fucking minutes. Dead ass. Really? Dead ass. Damn. And the phone just cut out. Waited thirty minutes, and the phone just cut out. Wow. That sucks. Well, there's a lot of people on there. There's a lot of people on there. Yeah, you waited 30 minutes and the phone just cut out. What up, dog? Hold up, give me a second. What's up? Chill out. You change the diaper? Yeah, go, yeah, go ahead. You can change the diaper. No, I'm right here. I'm back. Get you back. No, no you my wife has it. You gonna leave the baby? Bro. Man, that's crazy. No, my wife's over there. You gonna leave the baby? Where's she, she at? Let's talk to she's her. She's gonna breastfeed her. Hey, dude. Bro, I've been following you for like, since you got out of jail for a while. And uh, yeah. I need your advice. So I just sold the car, right? And I got like 40K off the car. Cause you know how the car market's kind of crashing a little bit going down. And so, yeah. what do you would you recommend uh, putting those forty k into? Oh, you got a breath. Oh no, you got a breath. there, you know, breath. taking the. My daughter kind of took a while, but, um, yeah, what do you recommend, man? People keep saying like real estate, but I don't know. What would you do? I mean, to be honest, bro, if you yeah, just so bought I had, it, you so just I had, I had the that car for like 10 years since I was, because I'm 27. And I bought the car when I was like 18 or, yeah, around 18, 17. And so I got rid of it. Yeah. And you sold the car for 40K. And, yeah, and I already, you already have, have a, a little, a little, you know, dupli, a little, you know, old car that I drive around that I'm trying to like, you know, level up and, and try to like, Okay, so maybe you should take the 40 and put it in credit. What do you mean in credit? It, it's not bad. Score, I mean, I have, I have a house and everything. Like, my credit score is like probably like 720, 710. So you, I have, you have, a, have mortgage. a mortgage or you're paying rent? Okay. Just me and the so wife and my baby. I just had wife. a baby like four weeks ago. Okay, so you and your wife had no, a mortgage. No, I, 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 I bought my house before I got married. So she's not she's not on my mortgage. Okay, so. Yeah. Or, I mean, well, obviously now that wife. we're married, it's, it's all one, yeah. Yeah. So you got some and that. we both have jobs. Like, she works and I work. We both have full-time jobs. Inside. Okay. So basically, the forty thousand yeah, dollars. you got a like a little shit car right little, now, right? A little Ford Focus. Okay, cool. Yeah, so I just had a baby. You got a baby, right? So, so maybe you should put your money into your credit so that you can get a better car, just in case the Ford Focus breaks down. My daughter's daughter Shailene. 
so you can ride Jaylene around. Well, my wife has a car, like, so I have that little daily or whatever, like, that I just drive around a little for focus, but my wife has, like, a newer car, like a 2017 Mazda CX-3. But why do I... Well, so I, why I, I had that, that, car? that car that I, that I sold, but I wanted to, like, you know, level up, and I want to, like, you know, invest that money. I just gave you the game. I just told you what to do. You just have to fix and, just, and build your credit, bro. But you don't think... Do you know what a, do you know what a secure know. credit card is? A we'll secure credit card? All right. Yeah. Do you know what a secure loan is? Nope. Okay. Go to the bank and ask them. And start from there with your 40000 Got you, dude. Hell yeah, man. Cool. So can you, you, I'm, I'm going to go ahead and let you go I'm, so you can go back in there. Man, and I'm, I'm a big today. fan, you know, you and Fresh and Fit. I watch, I watch you when you go on his channel, on their channel or whatever. But thanks, bro. Appreciate it. Yeah, yeah, yeah bro. Bye. Hang up, bro. Hang up. <sighs> hey, um, before y'all comment, right, with like weird stuff. Be careful, right? Because I will block my phone back. So I mean, you probably like, 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 you doing reports and your damn phone just yeah. I was like, damn, this is this cannot nah, be happening now. Not. I was but no, but man, I was just saying, like one thing I will say, I do admire about you. I love how you progressive, but I do like that you you don't just do one thing, and that's like what I feel like. A lot of people are like just trying to like follow, like just do what somebody else is doing instead of like thinking a little bit outside of the box. Yeah. Like a challenge, I think, for me, because I'm kind of like independently yeah. corporate, but I would love to be more independent. But like independent, you probably recover more, but maybe, yeah, I don't know. Right. I'm actually trying to figure that out now. Well, um, what do you, what I got a couple plans? of ideas, I think, for. Um, as far I'm in beauty, so I do marketing. My background is like marketing, um, like corporate yeah. salon management, leadership. No, I actually I don't. Um, okay. I've done like do you, I made some like, monetization. I've got some money off of social media, yeah. but not to the point where I'll be like, I would stop like corporate. Yeah. You know what I mean? And that's what I feel like I know. Yeah, most people most people that don't run ads don't oh, make okay. too much so, money like, because you the have ads to run like ads more so visibility, not necessarily like. Yeah, yeah. So, for instance, like, let's say if you spend, I don't know what you spend on ads, mm -hmm. but most of these rappers out here, like, they don't even like. Let's say if you're a rapper, right, and you got music, and you are. If you are sitting mm -hmm. inside of people's, sending your music to people's DM, you will never, ever make it. Because most of the time, as me as a person, I'm going to look at your shit and just skip right past it. Because I'm going to say, like, if, like, let's say if I was looking for artists, that is not how I would want to find an artist. You will want to find an artist who is a, like a hustler who's out here, like, you know, leveling up to get to the next level mm -hmm. you feel me like you'll want somebody that's kind of like yourself like buzzing a little bit and boom you'll be like oh mm -hmm. okay cool let me put the bigger bag behind them you you feel me so that's where it comes with ads ads is like you can like say if i want to say i'm about to be in let's say texas tomorrow and i want to i want a flyer to go out i can literally make the whole texas see the flyer with ads you feel me? So everybody that's on Instagram, I can make Instagram. Okay, can make so every single person. So is that you my ad. like targeting that particular market, or is that?
Yes, that's a that's whatever market you want to target. Like any market you want to target, you just pay for it. Whether it's Google, whether it's Facebook, whether it's Instagram, whatever you want to do. So a lot of people are on TikTok. So it'll be like, um, you okay, can I target on TikTok. Like, it's like on, depending on what you like do on the streams, so Like I've done streams, right? I've understood. That. So for instance, like let's say, let's say, okay, look. I make a lot of money off OnlyFans, right? So I say, mm -hmm. if I make $50 a month off each person on OnlyFans, I say, why not just start doing promos, right? So then I say, all right, cool, I'm doing promos. they $200. So then I, I said, a lot of ads mm -hmm. behind them, it's almost like a subscription based OnlyFans because Correct. So that's like more about like thousands of people paying $200. That's actually more money than OnlyFans. So if I made all these millions off OnlyFans, imagine what I, I need to think about that because you know that's funny you say that because like what I do for work, corporation manage so large, we we are membership based. We are the most profitable only because of memberships. You know what I mean? So it's like, why are you saying I'm like, damn? So maybe I yeah. You have, we pay a lot of money for but, marketing, so I, but I mean, you got to run a lot of ads. They got, Otherwise, you're going to waste your time. Millions and billions of dollars. But so you say I should try to run ads. So I need to figure out which lane the ads should be in. And then I guess figure out. So then what would you say? Okay, so with the ads, what do you feel like is like appropriate for somebody who's just like, just kind of starting with ads? Like I got like my inbound marketing from my. It just depends on what type of bag you got. First of all, you need to build your personal credit to get business credit. Then you mm -hmm. might get, mm -hmm. depending on how good your personal credit is and you get business credit cards, you use the business credit cards to, you know, fund your business. Depending on how much you believe in yourself, you can use that business credit card. Let's say if it's a $200,000 business credit card, you can um, take that 200000 and put it into ads. And make the money back. Pay the credit card back. They gave you a higher limit, and it'll be like six hundred thousand. With the business credit, but that's not going to be based off. That's based off of what I want to put into myself. Get, I'm saying, getting the the business. You said what? So most people. Let me tell you, like what most people do. So what most people would do if they would get a business credit card is like. Go open up a shop. They'll go get a car. They'll go get this. They'll go do that. And they'll be like, okay, cool. I got this nice stuff. You know, everybody, hey, look at me. But don't nobody notice it. It's in the market. They don't pay people. Like, like if I give you the opportunity to, to promo you, right, or if I give you the opportunity to say, like, all right, we can, you can do mentorships and you can be with me. And you can do this, this, and this, and you don't take it, right? But you might go do this. You might got jewelry. You might got this nice car, but don't nobody know your ass. So it's clearly showing like you ain't no shit. You understand what I'm saying? That's how like life is turning into. It's like you can have all this, but it's like you know, you Absolutely. are only known in this little bitty ass group of people. You feel me? Because in order to get seen like they okay. really want to get seen. Okay, so, okay, so with the 200,000, I feel That's like that's really what it is. Like, extremely unrealistic for somebody myself like starting out with like a lot of credit for business. That's why you go. That's why you go build your credit. That's you notice that I tell people that, like, just get your credit fixed and then work on the business credit. Learn a credit system all the way, or get with somebody well, the next who year. knows the credit system. That's the whole reason why you have mentors out here. Mm -hmm. You get with them, and they will tell you all the fucking secrets, and then you'll be the biggest person around. But a lot of people, especially on Instagram, cheap as fuck. So you, you got to realize, like, you got to go off of what they do. You know what I mean? But the be the realistically thing is, like, just it's just straight ads. You got to force I'm traffic. It's just it. I'm, forcing traffic. I'm open to, to try. I mean, I feel like I do know, like, with business, you have to spend some money to make money. That's just, like, common sense. But, like, when it like inbound marketing, you do have to be visible. You do have to have a presence. 
let me tell you let me tell you something you ever see you ever see you know every so right do you notice that if they got friends but you don't really know their friends like that that's because maybe the friend isn't disciplined enough to actually market and boost their self up as well if they were smart they would you okay let's say if my friend was bill gates right you can hang around bill gates but if you don't like you use the market you to attach yourself to bill gates to actually correct. blow up off of bill gates then you're just a regular ass bill gates correct. friend and you're just going to be replaced soon and you pointless as fuck so a lot of people are so stupid they be like oh if i get around this person no they got to be willing to open a door and teach you. They got to be willing to say, hey, bro, get around me and I'm going to teach you how to capitalize off me as well as you need to do this, 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 and this to blow up. Mm -hmm. But everybody is cheap or they don't want to listen and they think they know it all. You feel me? So that's why they stay regular. Even if they go get they can go get a nice watch, a nice car, a nice crib, all that. Nobody sees it. Just like me. Uh, a lot of these niggas gotta go to a clip mm -hmm. so I don't I can just DM a bitch like if I wanted a bitch you know like, these well, niggas I mean, gotta go to the club stand around do this do that you feel me because I I'll say alright look I'll say okay a party this Saturday where at niggas like oh well man it's gonna be busting that da -da 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 Saturday I'll run ass on the ass in that area yeah I'll run ass mm -hmm. in that area so look, I run ads. I spend like twenty racks. So every without me being there, everybody gonna see me that day. The whole time they get getting dressed, all the way till they get back home and get on Instagram and scroll, they gotta see Correct. me. Correct. So I, I ain't gotta like go that. nowhere. See what I'm saying? Right. And still I make and still I make money. So all in a club looking crazy, looking goofy and all the shit. No, I ain't doing none of that unless I get paid. So long story short, it's like you just got to have the right knowledge and the right game. That's why I charge the fuck out of niggas. Like they got to pay because there's so much knowledge I can tell them that I ain't even telling you, you know? So it's just a lot of little secrets to stuff that you got to know. Like you learn the system, you can, it's like, like you can literally have like 10 credit cards. You get literally, literally you're supposed to have mm -hmm. like you can have as many LLCs oh, yeah. as you want. Some people got like 20 LLCs. So just imagine, mm -hmm. just imagine this. You got 20 LLCs, right? They all over two years. Each LLC is over two years. And you got a credit score of 800. Just think about it. And every LLC, you get a credit card for 100,000. And you probably got like three credit cards for each LLC. I mean, let's see. About to explode. Okay, so my other question for you, like, what are your thoughts on, like, um, like with all the, like, the virtual ways that you can invest right now with, like, the, I'm, not, I don't really understand so much, but I'm still learning about the, um, metaverse and all that type of stuff. So, like, what's your thoughts on, like, virtual investments right now? Since everything is going to like a fake world, do you feel like that's something that? Yeah, I have. I'm just yeah. like, you know, I'm so like, I already, I already I don't know. I'm just, I don't know. I'm like things I, I'm not really sure of. I'm like very uneasy. I'm just like the basic stuff, technology, corporation I'm used to, beauty that's already profitable. Like playing it safe. I think for me, I'm like very playing it safe. But I feel like what you told me the advice, we're kind of investing in myself. I really should probably beef it up a little bit. Yeah. I mean, like right now, that shit kind of dry. You should probably wait till like the bull run come, and right before it, you know, it like this is the thing. People out here know secrets, so certain people will know right before the bull run a hit, and then they're gonna tell high end people, and high end people will invest. Like a challenge, I think for me, because I'm kind of like independently yeah. corporate, but I would love to be more independent. Independent, you probably recover more, but maybe yeah, I don't know. Right. I'm actually trying to 
figure that out now. So um, what do you, what I got a couple plans? of ideas, I think, for, um, as far I'm in beauty. So I do marketing, my background is like marketing, um, like corporate yeah. salon management, leadership. No, I actually, I don't. Um, so I've done like, I've made you run monetization. Ads. I've got some money off of social media, yeah. but not the point where I'll be like, I would stop like corporate. Yeah. You know what I mean? And that's what I feel like I know. Yeah, most people most people that don't run ads oh, don't make okay. too much so money like, because you the have ads to run is like ads more visibility, not necessarily like. I don't. Yeah, yeah. So, for instance, like, let's say if you spend, I don't know what you spend on ads, mm -hmm. but most of these rappers out here, like, they don't even like. Let's say if you're a rapper, right, and you got music, and you are, mm -hmm. if you are sitting mm -hmm. inside of people's sending your music to people's DM you will never ever make it because most of the time as me as a person i'm gonna look at your shit and just skip right past it because i'm gonna say like if like let's say if i was looking for artists that is not how i would want to find an artist you will want to find an artist who is a, like a hustler who's out here like you know leveling up to get to the next level mm -hmm. you feel me like you'll want somebody that's kind of like yourself like buzzing a little bit and boom, you'll be like, oh, mm -hmm. cool. Let me put the bigger bag behind them. You, you feel me? So that's where it comes with ads. Ads is like, you can, like, say if I want to say, I'm about to be in, let's say, Texas tomorrow, and I want a, I want a flyer to go out. I can literally make the whole Texas see the flyer with ads. You feel me? So everybody that's on Instagram, I can make Instagram okay, so make every single person so is that you like targeting that particular market or is that yeah that's a that's whatever market you want to target like any market you want to target you just pay for it whether it's Google whether it's Facebook whether it's Instagram whatever you want to do so a lot of people are on TikTok so it'll be like um you okay, I see what you're saying. Like, TikTok. what platform it's like, on, depending on what you like, be on the streams. Road. So, like, I've done streams, right? I've understood that. So, for instance, like, let's say, let's say, okay, look, I make a lot of money off OnlyFans, right? So, I say, mm -hmm. if I make $50 a month off each person on OnlyFans, I say, why not just start doing promos, right? So, then I say, all right, cool. I'm doing promos. They two hundred dollars. So then I, I said a lot of ads behind them. It's almost like a subscription based only fans because correct. So that's like more like about thousands of people paying two hundred dollars. So that's actually more money than only fans. So if I made all these millions off hmm. only fans, imagine what I, I need to think about promos. that because you know that's funny you say that because like what I do for work, corporation manage so large, we. We are membership based. We are the most profitable only because of memberships. You know what I mean? So it's like, why are you saying I'm like, damn? So maybe I should. Yeah. You have, we pay a lot of money for but, marketing. So I, but I mean, you got to run a lot of ads. They got otherwise you're gonna waste your time. millions and billions of dollars. But so you're saying I should try to run ads. So I need to figure out which lane the ads should be in. And then I guess figure out. So then what would you say? Okay, so with the ads, what do you feel like is like, appropriate for somebody who's just like just kind of starting with ads like i got like my inbound marketing from my it just depends on what type of bag you got first of all you need to build your personal credit to get business credit then you mm -hmm. might get mm -hmm. depending on how good your personal credit is and you get business credit cards you use the business credit cards to you know fund your business depending on how much you believe in yourself you can use that business credit card. Let's say if it's a two hundred thousand dollar business credit card, you can um, take that two hundred thousand and put it into ads and make the money back. Pay the credit card back. They gave you a higher limit, and it'd be like six hundred thousand. With the, the business credit, going. Going, but that's not going to be based. Off, that's based off of what I want to put into myself. Get, I'm saying, get in the the business. You said what? So most people, let me tell you like what most people do. So 
what most people would do if they would get a business credit card they it's like go open up a shop they'll go get a car they'll go get this they'll go do that and they'll be like okay Hey, cool, I got this nice stuff. You know, everybody, hey, look at me, but don't nobody notice it. It's in the market, they don't pay people. Like, like if I give you the opportunity to, to promo you, right, or if I give you the opportunity to say, like, all right, we can, you can do mentorships and you can be with me. You can do this, this, and this, and you don't take it, right? But you might go do this. You might got jewelry. You might got this nice car, but don't nobody know your ass. So it's clearly showing like you ain't no shit you understand what i'm saying that's how like life is turning into it's like you can have all this but it's like you know you Absolutely. are only known in this little bitty ass group of people you feel me because in order to get seen like they Correct. really want to get seen okay so okay so the 000, I feel that's like that really what it is like extremely unrealistic for somebody myself like starting out with like a lot of credit for business That's why you go. That's why you go build your credit. That's you notice that I tell people that, like, just get your credit fixed and then work on the business credit. Learn a credit system all the way, or get with somebody well, the who you, knows the credit system. That's the whole reason why you have mentors out here. Mm -hmm. You get with them, and they will tell you all the fucking secrets, and then you'll be the biggest person around. But a lot of people, especially on Instagram, cheap as fuck. So you, you got to realize, like, you got to go off of what they do. You know what I mean? But the be the realistically thing is, like, just it's just straight ads. You got to force uh -huh. traffic. It's just Boy, I'm, forcing traffic. I'm open to, to try. I mean, I feel like I do know, like, with business, you have to spend some money to make money. That's just, like, common sense. But, like, when it's like inbound marketing, you do have to be visible. You do have to have a press. Yeah. Let me tell you. Let me tell you something. You ever see? You ever see? You know every so. Like, do you notice that if they got friends, but you don't really know their friends like that? that that's because maybe the friend isn't disciplined enough to actually market and boost their self up as well. If they were smart, they would you okay, let's say if my friend was Bill Gates, right? You can hang around Bill Gates, but if you don't like use the marketing you just know to attach yourself to Bill Gates to actually Correct. blow up off of Bill Gates, then you're just a regular ass Bill Gates Correct. friend. You're just gonna be replaced soon. And you pointless as fuck. So a lot of people are so stupid. They be like, oh, if I get around this person. No. They got to be willing to open a door and teach you. They got to be willing to say, hey, bro, get around me and I'm going to teach you how to capitalize off me as well as you need to do this, 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 and this to blow up. Mm -hmm. But everybody is cheap or they don't want to listen and they think they know it all. You feel me? So that's why they stay regular. Even if they go get they can go get a nice watch, a nice car, a nice crib, all that. Nobody sees it. Just like me. Uh, a lot of these niggas got to go to a clip. Mm -hmm. So I don't, I can just DM a bitch. Like if I wanted a bitch, you know, like these well, I mean, niggas got to go to the club, stand around, do this, do that. You feel me? Because I, I'll say, all right, look, I'll say, okay, a party this Saturday, we're at. Niggas like, oh, well, man, it's going to be busting that da -da 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 Saturday. I'll run ads on their ass in that area. Yeah, I'll run ads in that area. So, look, I'll run ads. I'll spend, like, 20 racks. So, every without me being there, everybody going to see me that day. The whole time they get getting dressed, all the way till they get back home and get on Instagram and scroll, they got to see Correct. me. Correct. So I, I ain't got to like go nowhere. See what I'm saying? Right. And still a make and still a make money. So all in the club looking crazy, looking goofy and all the shit. No, I ain't doing none of that. Unless I get paid. So long story short, it's like you just gotta have the right knowledge and the right game. That's why I charge the fuck out of niggas like they gotta pay because there's so much knowledge I can tell them that I ain't even telling you, you know? So it's just a lot of little secrets to stuff that you gotta know. Like you learn the system. 
you can it's like, like you can literally have like 10 credit cards you get literally literally you're supposed to have mm -hmm. like you can have as many llc's oh, yeah. as you want some people got like 20 llc's so just imagine just imagine this you got 20 llc's right they all over two years each llc is over two years and you got a credit score of 800 Just think about it. And every LLC, you get a credit card for a hundred thousand, and you probably got like three credit cards for each LLC. I mean, let's you about to explode. Okay, so my other question for you, like, what we are your thoughts fall. on like, um, like with all the like the virtual ways that you can invest right now with like the I'm not, I don't really understand so much, but I'm still learning about the um metaverse and all that type of stuff so like what's your thoughts on like virtual investments right now since everything is going to like a fake world do you feel like that's something that yeah i have i'm just yeah. like you know i'm so like, i already, I already I don't invested know. I'm in just, this i don't know i'm like things I, i'm not really sure of i'm like very uneasy i'm just like the basic stuff technology corporation i'm used to beauty that's already profitable like playing it safe i think for me i'm like very playing it safe but I feel like what you told me the advice would kind of invest in myself. I really should probably beef it up a little bit. Yeah. I mean, like right now, that shit kind of dry. You should probably wait till like the bull run come, and right before it, you know, it like this the thing. People out here know secrets, so certain people will know right before the Correct. bull run and hit. And then they're going to tell high-end people, and high-end people will invest. Because, like, my thing, I feel like sometimes it's, like, a challenge. I have, like, do you feel like somebody should be, have separate, like, major se separate social medias? So, like, for me. Yeah, you can. It ain't, you can actually buy social medias. Like, you could buy built-up social medias off a site called FameSwap. You can, like, so... You know how like a lot of people don't never want to build up um, 